like television series which have uh, which keep returning season after season you have season 1 season 2 and, and so on and so forth and it's an endless spate of these series this polarization wapsi is also depending on the poll season should we put an end to it that's the debate starting with a comment from kiran rijiju just 15 minutes ago once again taking to twitter and tanvi pointed this out that i am extremely frustrated with congress and a section of the media first look at what the congress said I only responded to a diabolical statement. So he is called the Congress's statement and the press release that he on, on, on Friday diabolical. That's what he has done. And the comment is that the Narendra Modi government in the center and the BJP government in Arunachal is turning the state into a Hindu state. Let's say good evening to our panelists and let's debate this gentleman and the lady in the midst. Dr. Sambit Patra, Dr. Fuad Alim, Ratan Sharda. Dr. Tasleem Rahmani, Dr. Ghansham Tiwari, Dr. John Dayal and Kumar Kitkar. Good evening to all of you. First up, Friday the comment made Sambit Patra. Plenty of doctors, so let's surgically dissect this entire comment and then try and put it back together into some semblance of uh, sanity and uh, making some sense out of this entire debate on polarization Wapsi. Why is it? That the comment was made on Friday and Kiran Rijiju wakes up to it on Monday. Were you waiting Anand, for you polling on Saturday? Fact, not at all. Anand, that's the, I mean, your question itself puts a full stop to the uh, opposition's ruling that this was all done for polarizing the UP elections. So naturally, if we had to polarize and if such kind of statement had to be issued, so why would have anyone waited? So it in fact demolishes the opposition argument that we were polarizing the Uttar Pradesh election. Number one, before I speak on what Mr. Rijiju had tweeted, we have to remember one fact categorically that yes, Mr. Rijiju is a minister for the whole country, but he represents the state of Arunachal Pradesh because he is also a member of parliament from Arunachal Pradesh. So naturally when there was an attack on Arunachal Pradesh, which recently had a BJP government only about two months ago, by the... Uh, Pradesh Congress Committee which released the statement saying that the Modi government was trying to saffronize the state and gradually convert the state into a Hindu state. It was a serious allegation to which naturally Mr. Kiran Rijiju, who is a known leader from Arunachal Pradesh, responded to saying that this is absolutely bunkum. You tried to let me complete, sir. Let me complete. Sir, let me complete. Let me complete. Let me complete. You tried illegally and in a cynical way. Sir, forming a government is not. So do you mean you say all those members of legislative assembly were made Hindu. What are you saying? Okay, one minute, Dr. Rahmani, one minute. Let's go, let, let's go and cover this debate point by point. Dr. Rahmani, let him finish his point and then you can make your counter. Let him finish his point, you can make your counter, Dr. Rahmani. Sambit Patra, quickly though, quickly though, you've given a lot of value to this, uh, this statement of yours and the clarification that Kiran Rijiju has already given. But just a very basic question when you answer, make your point, Dr. Sambit Patra. Because Does it behove a minister, a, a sitting MOS, to even get to this level, irrespective of what Congress or any other party is indulging into? No, no, you have to be categorical over here. The Congress stated they that we are converting Arunachal Pradesh. They don't have any Mr. other Mr. Rahmani, don't dis Mr. Rahmani, don't disturb a surgeon when he is operating, please. The patient, that is a debate, uh, may be jeopardized. Don't do that. Be cool. You'll have your own term when you have to speak. Number one. I know, See, over I know, here, I know Congress this is a debate and what kind Sir, of debate please do, let I me speak. Oh, you know what kind of debate I do? It is for, for the whole country to see right now who is jumping into the whole debate, who is trying to destroy the debate. So please don't disturb me. Let me complete. Thank and you. I'm, I'm Number sure one, you we have to... Know, I'm sure you also Sir, know what this is not a personal tutu mai mein. Please, sir, you are, you are the best debater of the world. Thank you so much. Please don't disturb me. Yes. Number one. But we have to remember that the Congress is an important political party in this country. Mm. And Arunachal Pradesh Congress, in fact, uh, releases a statement saying that the Prime Minister of this country, Mr. Modi, is trying to convert the state of Arunachal Pradesh into a Hindu nation, mm. into a Hindu state. But you know, his Sorry, comment, you know state. that, uh, right, uh, Kiran Rijiju's tweet says Hindu population is reducing in India because Hindus never convert yes. people. I no. understand you, uh, you, no. you may say that the trigger point was, uh, was what Congress and the Arunachal Pradesh Congress Committee was saying. But the tweet really was about India. 
and he is after all uh, also a sitting minister sambhat no, it, it would have been yeah, appreciated what did he tweet no, he, uh, no the, i understand let me let me complete you will get the answer once i complete kind of a once i complete you will get the answer for change i'm taking too long to complete your answer yeah no 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 i'm just completing all of you are jumping in the middle of it number 1 See over here, what Mr. Kiran Rijiju has said are just facts. Mm. He says no, we are not converting Arunachal into a Hindu mm. state because of the very fact that Hinduism does not allow conversion. Yeah. So so so, so when pra Praveen Togadia claimed, when Praveen Togadia claimed, Ratan Sharda, come into the debate, please, and and we can bring no, the others. Hinduism, when Praveen Hinduism Togadia claimed, allow conversion. We are that that, allows, that we have that the V S W Hindu Parishad. Which one Hindu Parishad converted more than five lakh Christians and two point five lakh Muslims to Hinduism in the last ten years? Wrong statement. And then Kiran Rijiju says Hindus never convert people. So which is true? Which is false? Rather than saying which is true? Which is false? We which is true which is false people into hinduism you do not yeah, smoke money allow somebody yeah, to speak yeah. what is the garbhi movement sambit patra and dr rahmani please, 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 please wait please wait what is garbhi no, movement I, i need to get these questions out of the way before i come to one big aspect when let's see how vocal and how vociferous dr rahmani is then but first ratan sharda 5 lakh people 5 lakh christians 2.5 lakh muslims to hinduism in the last 10 years is a claim pravin togadia laid and then today you have kiran rijiju saying hindus never convert people Which is true? Which is false, sir? Why should I juxtaposition what Praveen Togadia says or what Kiran Rijiju says? Let me make my statement because I am not come here to defend either Togadia or Kiran Rijiju. Hmm. First of all, let's look at the fact: the so-called Hindu state of Arunachal Pradesh, whose population is ninety nine point two one percent was either Donne Polo followers or Buddhist or Hindus or indigenous faiths, dropped to eighty one point three percent in two thousand eleven. The whole Arunachal Pradesh is dotted with churches. Where there are no people, where there are people, there are Buddhist everyone. And Manipur population, Hindus and local Buddhist Hindus, 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 Manipur they have 5585 churches there and they convert openly they support separatists they persecute local populations and not only that in 1989 the same congress manifesto said we will bring christian socialism they said we will have based on biblical teachings we will revise school syllabus to orient with christian principles they will issue guidelines from the presbyterian church and they would 100% liquor ban because church wanted it rajiv gandhi said the state party will follow church guidelines mm. this is the state of christianization of northeast with the benign eyes of congress yes. so if this is what to the why, for the people what's wrong okay. with that talking of population of john dayal john, john dayal okay. respond 70% listen muslim in 24.6 hindu population dropped from 84 to 79% muslim population increased from 90 wait ratan sharda you are quoting the numbers what hang on hang on hang on ratan sharda let john dayal respond let john dayal respond we are standing by for a reaction from kiran rijiju from goati is an exclusive we will play that soon After uh, it's, it's just getting ready to be played out for our viewers, but John Dayal responded to Ratan Sharda. John Dayal responded to Ratan Sharda. Shut up! I'll expose you. You are the biggest broker of Ratan Sharda. Ratan Sharda. Ratan Sharda. Allow John Dayal to respond. Allow John Dayal to respond. No, no, you don't have any right to speak. Sir, allow John Dayal to respond, please. John Dayal cannot respond. We have a message. Let me decide that. Let us decide that, please. Ratan Sharda. Ratan Sharda, when you are the moderator of the debate, you decide who speaks. Right now, we are the moderators. Allow us to decide who speaks, who doesn't. Ratan Sharda, please wait. And John Dayal goes to the West. Ratan Sharda, please wait. Begging for money to convert people. Ratan Sharda, please wait. He's coming here to teach me. Ratan Sharda, please. Please, please, no personal accusations. You are talking about numbers and statistics. Let him respond on that. You know, Mr. I, Mr. I, Ratan Sharda, I, I let's maintain the decorum. I yes, don't take money from the IS. John Dayal, I don't take money from the IS. John Dayal, ignore the personal comment, please. Let's, let's get back to the debate. It from is, is not. From books and it is papers. not a crime to be a Christian. India allows. Any yeah. individual. It's not a crime to, to be a Hindu either. It is not even crime to Hindu it's, also. It, yeah, it's not a crime to be a Hindu either. Christian and Muslim. Yeah. Yeah. I can't speak about Hindu. Yeah. It's, it's not a crime to. It's not a crime to follow any faith of your choice. Yes, Ratan Sharda, we've said that. Let John Dayal respond. Let John Dayal respond. Ratan Sharda, please. Ratan Sharda, please. Ratan Sharda, please. I'm I'm going to urge you to please. Is this the perverse cup of communism? Where I cannot speak about Hindu. Ratan Sharda, exercise restraint, please. I'm going to request you, sir. Is this the minority? I'm going to request you, sir. I'm going to. 
request you, sir, for the last time. Yes, John Dyer. I will not teach anybody. It is not a crime to be Hindu. John Dyer. It is not a crime to be Christian. He is not saying that either. John Dyer, go ahead, please. Let me say one thing. Let 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 me say one thing. Yeah. In this country, hmm. I have rights as a citizen. Hmm. I have rights to demand my security. Hmm. I have rights, and it is not illegal hmm. to be a Christian. It is not illegal, illegal to convert. John, they are your secure. That's why sitting here babbling. If you are not secure, Mr. Sharda, Mr. Ratan Sharda, you got your fair amount of time. You got your fair amount of time to put forward your data, Ratan Sharda. I am going to interject here. You got your fair amount of time to put forward your data. You did not even respond to the question that was actually put forward to you. So you are not going to sit here and decide, Ratan Sharda, which way the debate is going to go, sir. Please allow the other side to also respond. And do not make any personal remarks about anybody. You've made Learn your point. You've given your data. Let John Dyer respond. Have discussion. any motives imputed? Okay, you know no. what? I am going to ask both of you. I am going to ask both thinking. of you to calm down for a minute. This cannot continue on the debate. We I need to hear about. all sides of the story, and we need to debate this in a proper I manner. So please hold back. I want to. We are going to play peaceful. out a reaction that we have gone from got this from Kiran Rijiju, the Minister of State for Home Affairs, has spoken exclusively to us. Let's try and play out that reaction for you, and then we'll come back to this debate, and hopefully there will be more decorum by then. We are joined in by MOS home, Mr. Kirin Rizju, whose uh, recent tweet uh, that uh, Hindu is reduced to minority just because they are not converting. Would like to know from you what you actually meant by that tweet. Actually, the Congress Party, out of blue, made a very atrocious statement, saying that Modi ji and the BJP government is uh, converting Arunachal Pradesh into a Hindu state. This was totally unnecessary and very, very irresponsible statement by the Congress party. Arunachal Pradesh is uh, full of tribals and various tribals have their own identity. All the tribals are living peacefully and harmoniously. Some of the tribals have converted to Christianity and few of them also have been converted to Islam also. But the individual choice cannot be disturbed because the constitution provides freedom to each individual to have his own faith of the choice. The Congress statement is very political in nature. So I have just made a clarification that Congress should not make this kind of irresponsible statement. And on that basis, I have also stated that the Hindus do not have a system of conversion. Because in Hinduism, there are various Varnavaran within which people fall into different categories. The tribals do not fall into any category, but at the same time, we practice many things which is very similar to each other. So it's a perfect harmony. There is no reason for the Congress party to make such a statement. Secondly, if you see, before the division of this country, and after the country is divided, the proportion of Hindu population has decreased. The growth rate of Hindu population is decreased for various reasons. So this statement of Congress is wrong that Hindu is a, a religion which is a, converting other people into its fall. Hinduism do not have the system of conversion. So there is no question of Hindus bringing other people of other faiths into its fold. So it's very simple. Second very important point is all the religious minorities around India do face certain problems. 
religious persecution or some other issues. These religious minority groups, whoever are facing problem, they always come to India. They converge into India only because they feel safe in India. Okay, he again reiterates that point uh, that uh, what I meant was that as part of Hinduism, there yeah, is no conversion in our religion. Perhaps Ghar Vapsi is a different concept, but uh, we'll have to ask the VHP and the RSS and all the other motor mouth netas uh, of the BJP on that. Uh, and we'll come back to that point that he raised. But I, I also want to go back to John Deal. Ratan Sharda has put forward a bunch of statistics. You know, just to put it in simple words, John Deal, in 2001, Christians were the third largest religious group, accounting to, for 18.7% percentage of the state's population in Arunachal Pradesh. According to the 2011 census, 10 years later, John Dayal, this, this had gone up, their proportion had gone up to 30.26% in the state's 1.3 million people population. That's the figure from 2001 to 2011 that we have, where, the, where continuously we've seen the proportion of Christians grow. Uh, as a pro pro proportion of total uh, population in the state. Now, that's the data we have. Is there data that you have that to suggest that since now BJP uh, government has come into power in Arunachal Pradesh, the trend has reversed and significantly and that it's, it's a cause of worry because the Congress hasn't give us, uh, given us anything all day today, yesterday, no, they haven't no, given no, us no, any data. Is there any data that anybody can give us on that? But ma'am, I'm not the Congress spokesman. Yes, and I'm asking I you, is, do you two, have any data? Because two, we've two not things. got from anywhere today. Two, two. Yeah, yeah. I think there is data that in 1911, there were no Hindus in Arunachal. Where did the Hindus come from? It is legal. That's what I'm trying to say. It is not illegal. Okay, I need to come in. Who were they in 1911 Arunachal Pradesh then? Who were the Americans? Americans living in Arunachal Pradesh in 1911. Who are they? What are you Who talking? Are we, no, 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 I'll Find tell you the data. Find I'll out. tell you the data. Find 2001, 2001, 34.6% no, 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 no. I am talking of 1911. So, so, so who was there who in 1911? No, no, Sambit Patra, let's listen to it. Sambit Patra, Sambit Patra. No, no, let's ask, let's ask, let's, let's listen. Who was there in 1911? Ratan Sharda, to all of us. Who was there in 1911? The point I'm making is, there are Hindus in Arunachal Pradesh. Are they not? Yes. So Why should there be no Muslims or Christians in Arunachal Pradesh? Who's saying no to that? So who is no, no, who is saying no to that? No, no, but just because, just who is because, see, no to that? sir, my problem, no, no, my problem, Mr. Mr. John Dayal, my problem, Mr. John Dayal, Dr. John Dayal, is that when there is a number of minorities which is growing, if the Christian population grew is that between crime? 2001 is to illegal? 2011, then there is no, there is no issue. But suddenly, if there is a growth or if there is a resurgence of perhaps what is the majority faith in the country, that is the Hindu population, why is there this psychosis which is being built by the Congress party? Why don't you take objection to the Congress party's comment no that you are converting it to a Hindu state? Why? Is it a problem if people are Hindus? Is the Congress so anti-Hindu? Or are they fear-mongering with the fact that if people are following Hinduism, it's a big problem? I, no, why, why, why aren't I you see, taking offense to that, I, sir? Yes, I, you should take offense I to the comment which offense, Mr. Which, uh, which Mr. Kiran Rijiju made. You can take exception to, to it, the sir. Political party yes, but you should call out the Congress party for the tone they use. At all. I condemn the BJP. I condemn the Congress. Thank you for that. Let's get to our other panelists. Uh, Ratan Sharda, sir, I'll come to you. I'll come to you. Let's just pre open the debate and bring our other panelists also. Kumar Ketkar, Fuad Alim, yeah, and Gansh Yeah, I don't understand. Why and how Congress will benefit by polarizing the public? Hmm. Hmm. I don't understand. I really? think Congress understands. They are the ones who I keep saying, Congress, I sir, think Congress knows that it's Mr. Ketkar, Mr. Ketkar, you are a senior because You know very well, you know very well that their trick is very, sir, their trick is very clear. Oh, they are, they are going to forcefully convert you. It's a threat to the minority. So, so the moment, moment a Hindu dominated party comes, they are going to take everything, your rights away from you. That's exactly what they're doing. If Congress polarizes, it loses. 
because eighty percent of the population is Hindu. What is the point? So then, why did the they make that comment? What is the so advantage did, of Congress? Why did they make that point? Why did they make the point? That's a Congress of people. In a country, in a country where the majority of the population is Hindu, please don't tell us that any political party has not tried to appease the other communities. No, no, no. That logic and that that logic doesn't work, Mr. Kedkar. Congress is polarizing. Congress does not benefit the population. In a country where Hindus are in majority, Congress. And other political parties. Don't tell me you are I saying they have never indulged in appeasement politics. About which is about, about other I minorities. About other people's Can I reply to Why Mr. Does Kedkar? Congress benefit by polarizing? No, because Congress also. Why knows. doesn't the Congress? How does it not benefit? How does it not benefit by polarizing? Don't close your eyes to the truth, Mr. Kedkar. You are not. No, no. Are you trying to say? Are you trying to say the Congress doesn't benefit? Say the Congress is pragmatic. Does anybody? Does anybody? Does anybody? Does anybody? Does anybody? Do, do you believe Mr. Kedkar's statement because here? Because you are saying Mr. in the last 60 Sir, years... Sir, you are saying that Congress is polarizing. In the last 60 years, has what a political party not Congress, indulged in appeasement Congress politics to reach out to minorities? They are a minority. Have they never reached them out to change the number way? Not just polarizing. Okay, okay. Is supporting Dr. Patra, Dr. Patra, Kumar Kedkar believes that Congress does not benefit by polarizing. Obviously not. The reason why the Samajwadi party has allied with the Congress party is because it will be able to secure and the Muslim vote bank and honor the minority vote bank. So very clearly they are pandering. Sir, they are pandering to a vote bank. They are trying to create a psychosis saying, all right, create a fear psychosis that they are out to get you. You mean to say that is no, sir. This comment, no, this comment has been made. This comment has been made by the Congress party with a malified intent. The Congress has been, the Congress has made this comment. The Congress has made this comment. The Congress has made this comment. No, to the power Congress, getting, the Congress they, has made will it this or will it not help the them in the current election sir, season? Bring, the, bring, bring them to power to where? We are not power. talking 2019. The Congress has... No, sir. The majority of the sir, let's, sir. Let's ask Dr. Fuad Ali majority in his state. Let's ask Dr. Fuad Ali in his state. Also, we've seen a lot of appeasement politics play out. Uh, How do you prove that polarizing? The con, let's sir, the ask Congress him. Has let's ask him the whether it benefits to play these kind of polarizing politics or not. How benefit Congress by polarizing? Mr. Kedkar, please tell me this. Please tell me this. Please tell me this. Please tell me this. Was it was it the Congress's strategy in the run-up to 2014 and after 2014? No, 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 sir. The line has always been Narendra Modi has come to power. The BJP has come to power. They are out to get you. That has been the but message to the there, minorities. Mujhe mujhe no, that no, that has been there. No, so when, so so when, so why didn't the Congress? No, why didn't the Congress have a problem, sir? When when the Hindu population reduced from 30, sir, when the Hindu, when the Hindu population, sir, when the Hindu, hear me here, sir. Hear me, hear me, Mr. Kedkar. Hear me out, Mr. Kedkar. Why didn't the Congress party have a problem between 2001 to 2011 party? when the Hindu I and the, and the Pongi? No, sir. You are charging Congress. Sir, I am merely asking the, how does Congress when, benefit? When, 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 the number, Congress. when the number... Mr. Kedkar, in I all of your experience, you also know, in no, all sir. of your... No, it's not. No, it's not. When it comes to Uttar Pradesh, when it comes to Uttar Pradesh, when it comes to West Bengal, when it comes to Lawrence Tell me something. No, it's not. It's not. Politics works. The religion politics works. Do you mean works. to say that Congress wants to alienate the majority? No, and sir. The, they, the, co the Congress, to to the Congress, Congress wants to alienate. The Congress wants to alienate the minority will from the majority. Will they be That's what they want, Mr. Kedkar. Because be please, please hear me out. Time, tell me this, time. sir. Tell me this. Look at this number. But don't forget. No, no, no. Look at this number. No, no. Look at this number. Ideology. Tell me. You so are tell me this, no, sir. Why is it that the Congress party didn't have a problem when the number of Hindus and Doni Polo in Arunachal reduced by 11 percent in 10 years. When it reduced by 11 percent in 10 years, why did they keep quiet? Why didn't they find out why it is happening? Why didn't they find out how it is happening? Why didn't they do it? I am merely asking. Dr. Fuad Ali. I am merely asking. Dr. Fuad Ali. Samit Patra. Samit Patra. Kumar Ketkar. There is a difference. Kumar Ketkar. There is a difference. As we go to Fuad Ali, there is a difference. Kumar Ketkar. An ideological statement or a political statement? No. Political 
एक्शन और एन आइडियोलॉजिकल एक्शन बट बॉय और गर्ल्स से डॉक्टर फुआद अली नाइन नाइन no my point is sir my my point is when when there was a mass when 11% of the population gets converted be it the doni polo that is the indigenous tribes and the indigenous beliefs or the hindu population gets converted to another religion and the state does not bother the state does not ask a question but but the moment there is one ghar wapsi campaign even though it has got no basis in fact because in hinduism there is nothing called reconversion there is nothing called convert there is no provision yes but that was a farce that was a farce and that should have been called out the okay. bjp did not call okay, it out sambit patra fuad ali fuad ali quickly quickly your point fuad ali why was there so much of silence that was being maintained when the demographics were changing for the last 10 years yeah all the surgeons enjoy the time you know the basic decency is not there let me be very clear all the religious groups in arunachal pradesh as per the data have increased in real terms the yeah of course increase the the indigenous groups have con- uh, increased the uh, christians have increased the muslims have increased the buddhists have increased let's be very clear in real term all the demographic components have increased the number two factor one has to keep in mind is that the polarization has always been there on behalf of the bjp please be rem- uh, reminded that when the governor of arunachal yes yes i'm with one minute coming to you in february 2016 he was referring to the slaughtering of a cow which was not a cow it was a mithun which was a, a, the the so where does the cow come in this arunachal pradesh well everything else fight. will come in sambit patra you have to understand governor, you have, you, you have to governor, understand when yes, this question governor, is asked it makes everybody governor, uncomfortable when when you have when you have certain other segments certain minority segments growing in various parts people don't have a problem the moment the majority segment starts growing or people start coming back to the majority faith or there is a perception that's created It, then there is a there is a problem why is it that people yes. should not have a problem if 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 muslims are growing if christians are growing if buddhists are growing but, but if hindus are growing the, why should the congress but party have a problem? a problem why should there be why is it forced let's, if it is if it is a hindu why is it why is it why is it why is it why 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 is it self a, a matter of choice and it is not induced if it is a muslim if it is a christian if it is a buddhist now this logic and why is it that nobody here is condemning outright what the congress said dr fuad ali Why aren't you first saying why aren't you first saying what the congress said in Itanagar is wrong why aren't you saying that what they said in fr- on friday is wrong oh i am changing the goal post you are changing it conveniently kumar ketkar because the co- it is a congress that polarized it is a congress that polarized it's a congress that polarized it's a congress that polarized it's a congress which first made the comment on friday the congress party started can you deny can you deny mr ketkar that the congress party is the one who has raised this issue that it is not kiran bijiji today the congress party in arunachal pradesh has raised the issue they did not raise the issue they did not raised the issue sir, between 2001 and 2011 when the demographics were changing and they were changing not in favor when the demographics when the demographics when the demographics were not changing in favor of the hindus they didn't have a problem they did not say anything at that point of time go across to mr rahmani go across to mr rahmani and gansham tiwari who haven't come in the debate in gansham tiwari but perhaps you can say a word or two about how it benefits or doesn't benefit when you when you appease a, a minority in a state Give and that and it's only only 30 seconds only only 30 seconds first because he is wanting to speak for a while you can there one minute please you had your chance let us get one more piece from all our panelists mr amani who is the piece who is the piece complain to uncle trump for last half a century complain to uncle sam half a century RSS and BJP is actively working over there to mm. foment 
conversion among us to many many tribals and the christian community this is a known fact half a century and yet the islam no 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 one second one second dr ramani what did you say dr ramani what did you say last half a century who is working half a century last half a century who is working kind of fast conversion has started no 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 they are doing it at the name of darwapsi they are trying to lure the last half a century who is working to do what most of the tribes are christian over there संबित पात्रा संबित पात्रा डॉक्टर रहमानी डॉक्टर रहमानी हैज सेलेक्टिवली इग्नोर्ड व्हाट हैपेन बिटवीन 2001 एंड 2011 ही इज सेइंग फॉर द लास्ट हाफ अ सेंचुरी देयर आर फोर्सेस वर्किंग नो नो सो यू वांट टू इफ यू इफ इफ देयर आर पीपल हु आर वर्किंग टू प्रमोट इंडिजिनस ट्राइब्स इट्स अ प्रॉब्लम इफ यू इफ देयर आर पीपल हु आर ट्राइंग टू से दैट यू रिटेन योर फेथ एंड वी विल हेल्प वी विल हेल्प यू वी विल हेल्प पीपल पीपल ऑफ ऑल वॉक्स एंड ऑल ऑल बिलीव्स टू ग्रो इट्स अ प्रॉब्लम इट इज बिकॉज़ ओनली इफ देयर रिलीजन एंड इफ देयर And, and and the segment that they are wanting to bat for that doesn't grow then it's a problem what is this logic I'll, how is that logic fair dr remani and that's why you are, yes, you are trying to change the demography who is changing the demography who is changing the demography when the demography changed the between 2001 and 2011 where were you dr remani when the 2011 census data came where were you did you raise your voice you did you turn around and say what is going on in arunachal and what is going on in the northeast did you say it sir do you are you on record saying it are you on record questioning the congress governments then and asking them why are they allowing this why this is happening suddenly in two years do you have any Can data do you have any hard data that 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 there is forced conversion happening that people are being forced back into hinduism what when that cannot even know? happen what, what, what is this mean i mean just you have some perception back back your back your claim with data back your claim with data where are the facts the other side is not giving us facts to lie there is actually a concern on there is changing demographics happening or as they say there is saffronization happening they are concentrating on northeast samit patra is there Saffronization happening? How much garbage has happened? Tell us. Anand, yes. I stand for the right of people to convert. When you called out for this debate, when when you called out for this debate, and as you play out the direct debate too, Doctor John Dayal, Doctor John Dayal, yes, yes, sir. Yes, yes, yes. Gun shot, Tiwari. Doctor John Dayal, Doctor John Dayal, Doctor John Dayal. What I am saying, Doctor John Dayal, is people who have made a choice of their own, people who have made the choice of their own, still have the still have the freedom to change their choice. I don't. Why should it be considered that it is made out of it is Done under the duress. Question. When they make the first choice, it is not I done under the duress. If they revert to I, I, their original choice or their I original belief, it is done under duress. How is that logic I, fair? I it's not fair. To, it's not fair, I sir. I want to state so as follows. Doctor Patra, before Doctor Patra, before I come to you, Gansham Tiwari, please. Right Gansham has not spoken. No, Doctor Tiwari has not spoken. Gansham Tiwari. I know, I know, I know, Doctor Patra, but allow him a word, please. Allow him a word, please. I, I, I request your patience. I request your patience, sir. Another, another thirty seconds. I think another thirty seconds, Doctor Patra, please. Gansham Tiwari. There is a fundamental flaw. There, there is a fundamental flaw to the way this argument has has progressed. Minister, Minister for for whom does not know the about a comment from his home state for uh, three days. He responds three, that he responds three days later. He does not know about 2011 census for five years, and he responds and suddenly. And, and, and he says instead of talking about Arunachal Pradesh, he starts talking about India. Instead, instead of talking about the communities within within the. Within, uh, did you read what the Congress has said? Did you read what the Congress has said? I wanted to explain this to us, and I am actually asking this question to all our panelists. Okay, one minute, one minute. The question is this: If you have a problem, if you have a problem. In terms of religious force, religious no, conversion. I, I problem, Why is it? If you have a problem with force, religious conversion, if you debate, don't have a problem with really it, the that question that one discussion. of you have raised tonight yeah, 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 and I, I should have is discussion. where is the anti-conversion law in the rebut. state of Arunachal Pradesh? A law that was uh, an who's act the, that was passed who's, who's and the, the laws under which were never made. Ganjal Kumar Tiwari, has your party asked this question to your ally? The Congress was in power. Look at the law was the there the rules were never made it was never implemented now if there is such a big concern what were they doing they were in power there you know that when they were in power john they are state lawlessness Arunachal Pradesh was the first first one of the first five states to come out with a law which never got implemented Anand. If it's such a big and problem about the conversions and forced conversions, where is the law? The whole world Why has law. nobody asked that the question to the Congress Party law. or to any of the Why, governments before or after that? I stand. 
I stand for the freedom of any Indian citizen to right. become a Hindu, to become a Muslim, to ah. become a Buddhist. You to become we all do, we all do. John, that's not the point here. Please, 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 that's not the point here. Please, 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 please also say, please also say. We're not here to give a lecture on how India is secular and we all stand for it. We all do. That's not the point here. Samit Patra. Tell me the point. Samit Patra, where is the anti-conversion law that should have been put in place? Will your government at least do it? The Congress didn't. They won't why even should? answer the question why, why they didn't do it. Put? Today they are sitting here why and crying foul without even the presenting data to us. Samit Patra. Fact. It's a terrible Only law. Only John Dayal should girl. stop shouting like this, number one. Hmm. Where were these hypocrites when Kashmir... Oh, I allow you to shout. Changing? Go ahead and shout. None of these, open, none of these hypocrites opened their mouth when demography of Kashmir changed. And today, though the Hindu population Who told you that? Who told you that? Pradesh, Who told you that? Despite I've the never heard you scream population that is Muslims increasing. were killed. Here they have the gumption of attacking the Bharti Janta Party and putting all wrong facts over here. Mr. John Dayal, I was not shouting protest. when you were talking. 2001, 34.6% John Dayal, please listen to Sambit Patra so that you can Mr. respond John to it. Don't, don't, don't be like this. Don't be filled with so hatred. Jesus will be angry with you if you shout like this. Yes, and, we, and the Lord will calm. curse you. We have to. If we don't do have that. to be fight. Fire we don't have to fight with each other. Shame. Don't please be Shame. calm. Be smiling. No, but you be bring this debate smile, smile. to this level. John, they are smiling. Doctor Patra, limited time. Let's you get back to the debate, sir. To the yes. Level. 2001. Doctor, they are. 2001. Please. Christian population yes. 30.2. 2002. 2002. Doctor, they are. Please let him make his point quickly. Is it a And then Gajam Tiwari. Polo reduced to 26.2. Yes, we have the numbers, sir. We are putting out the numbers. Sir, make your point. We are putting out the numbers. You're question putting out the numbers. Why? Make your point. The numbers of Hindus and the indigenous tribes are decreasing. Explain the reason. Why are you saying in a falsified mm. manner that there is an attempt to convert the state? Sir, what they are Hindu claiming, Doctor Patra, so what they are saying is between after two, between 2012 and 2017, India. what's happened well, after 2011? Years. They are claiming a scenario. My point is, Gansham Tiwari, before you make an argument and before you come out to con before no, you come out, about two no, no, please, Doctor Patra, one sec. Doctor Patra, one sec. Doctor Patra, one sec. Gansham Tiwari. Before you come out to criticize Kiran Rijiju, and you have every right to do so, you must say something about what the Congress said in Itanagar. Do you agree with what they said? Do you agree See, with their comment? I, they, they did it one day before, they they before phase they one of polling. Why did they do it? They did it one day. Ganshan Tiwari. Ganshan Tiwari. Yes, Ganshan Tiwari. If you ask a question, let Dr. Tiwari speak, please. Yes, Ganshan Tiwari. What, what Congress put out in Itanagar was put out on 10th February related to Arunachal Pradesh. Hmm. And here is a, here is a uh, minister, minister of Home. Why should they make that comment? Speaking up for the entire country. Why should they make that no, comment? Why, entire why should country? they make Freedom that comment? Freedom of speech is only for so you. Isn't the Congress also fear mongering? This is the same isn't logic. Isn't the Congress let also fear mongering? What let is the guarantee speak. that they are not doing that let on the ground speak. in Uttar Pradesh? What is the guarantee Anand, they are your allies? Speak. What is the guarantee you, they are not doing that in Uttar Pradesh? You what is the guarantee that they are not saying? For, for, look, look what they are doing in Arunachal. For, they will do that to you in Uttar Pradesh too. Okay. Look, you are under danger. You are in okay. danger. You are okay. under threat okay. because okay. you are a minority. Okay. Okay. You are not let, a Hindu. Let me, let me make a very simple is that, point. Is that is that fair? Let, let me make a very simple. Is, is that kind of politics fair? So is the Congress you, you practicing have, that? Is your ally minister. practicing that on you, ground, you, sir? You can you can you make a claim? Can you make a statement out here? Is your is your ally I'll practicing you that? You have a prime problem. minister. The basic problem you, you have a prime minister who said Mira Mira Chappa didn't cast his vote. You have a prime minister who thinks the, the moment I'm asking you a question of what the Congress and, and, and party is the, doing the, on ground, you have to chappa inch ki chati yaad aati hai. Chappa inch ki chati ka isse kya lena dena? Simple thing. Isse koi lena dena nahi hai. Main aapse ye puch raha hu. Main aapse puch raha hu. Is the Congress party making similar statements on ground in Uttar Pradesh? If that if they are doing that, they are doing a huge disservice. Can and you guarantee they are not? You are simultaneously, you are simultaneously you playing the that they are not? anchor and irritant. Can you Hear guarantee that they are not? Hear me through. Because, because what you are no, doing no, is, no, when I am asking what, you a straightforward question, about? you are giving BJ, me a convoluted BJP answer. Has, so has, I will, I will, I will, no, I will I'm force you, you to come back answer. to the issue. This is, this was a, this was a fringe news. The BJP purposefully brought fringe to news. the center. Fringe news. So Congress is fringe for you. So Congress party is fringe for you. You are, you have allied with the Congress party and you have called them fringe to 
right on the news hour. You, you said this was fringe news. In context Congress of party Pradesh, makes what they have Congress done party Pradesh makes a loaded statement clearly intent at polarizing. So the response from a BJP minister becomes a problem. But the Congress saying something is fringe news. An entire party gets wiped out. The Congress, Congress saying something is fringe news. I will tell you what is the main problem. Congress saying something is fringe news for the Samajwadi Party. The main problem over here is finances with the Congress. Number of NGOs with foreign funding have been clamped down. Sir, and the Congress is not receiving time. its funds from the foreign nations. That is the reason as Okay, now we are just going off track with the debate. Now we are just going off track with this debate. And I'm also we're running out of time, so I'll have to track. start wrapping this it up is right now. News, I'm telling you. No, no, okay. The point is this. We asked, we asked one side, we asked one side if there was data, because we didn't get any data from Congress party. Four days after they made that comment, after the news got out. Today there was a huge... One minute, please. Can I, can, can I speak now? Can I, can, can I speak now? Dr. Tiwari, I know you didn't get much time to talk, but it's time to wrap up, so allow me to do that, please. Because we didn't get any data from Congress party or anybody else to substantiate their claims that the, 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 there was a concern about changing demographics or saffronization in the state of Arunachal Pradesh. Which only makes us raise this question whether there was another motive in the middle of the political season, peak political season with five big states going to elections. Was there another motive towards Congress party first making this comment? Does it behove a union minister to t fall for that trap and make those kind of co comments? Perhaps not. But Kiran Rijiju has come out and explained his side. And there is enough statistics to really show what's going on in Arunachal Pradesh. So our only point tonight, to our limited point tonight is perhaps bad. political parties need to start introspecting when there is an actual change and concern, when there is an actual forceful conversion happening, yes raise your voice. Do not selectively raise your voice and do not selectively make it an issue when it only benefits you for your vote bank. Thank you so much viewers for joining us tonight on debate number two on the news hour.